Let's say we're given two functions, f of x equals 2x minus 4, and g of x equals x squared minus x plus 5. For this problem, we're asked to find f minus g of x. Recall that f minus g of x is simply f of x minus g of x. It's just notation for the subtraction or the difference of two functions. So here we replace f of x with 2x minus 4 and g of x with x squared minus x plus 5. Please make sure that you take care with subtraction. Always put the functions within parentheses. The reason why we do this is when we subtract, we must distribute the negative to the function on the right. So when we do this, negative times x squared will yield negative x squared, negative times a negative will yield a positive x, negative times a positive will yield a negative 5. Now once we've distributed the negative, everything's fair game. Now we can start looking for like terms. So here we see that the x squared unfortunately is sitting by itself, so it's just going to come along for the ride. The 2x and the x are like terms, so that's going to give us 3x. Negative 4 minus 5 will give us negative 9. That's exactly what we have next. Negative x squared plus 3x minus 9. And that's it.